Hello, welcome back to Georgie B's Cards and Stuff. Today I'd like to show you how I made this card using one of my new stamp sets and the new paper from Celebration Ombre paper. I can't remember. Ombre. Um, No, just there's paper on there. It's the ombre paper that you get from Celebration. Let me get it. As it's the newest one I've got, it was at the front of the drawer. Let's move that piece. And this is oh so ombre. Oh, that was easy enough. It comes in four colours. Bermuda Bay, Blackberry Brisk, Granny Apple Green, Rococo Rose, Whisper White. So I am using Bermuda Bay. And the stamp set's Darling Donkey. I'm going to be using that one. And the Hey There Friend. And the Happy Birthday comes from another new one. It's from Art Gallery. And I'm just using the Happy Birthday at that. I've made some cards with that. Which you'll see, or have seen, depending when this comes out. And these little pearls of stamping up pearls obviously I don't know what kind that's all I've got of the packaging I got them when I was on stage oh, whenever it was whenever I was last on stage a couple of years ago so I should use them Um, yeah, so our card base. Bermuda Bay, eight and a quarter by five and seven eighths, scored up four and one eighth, folded in half, and burnished. A piece of, oh yeah, two pieces of white, at five and five eighths by three and seven eighths, one for the inside. And one for the top, and I'm using the Bermuda Bay uh, patterned ombre paper. And on the si other side, it's got Rococo Rose, so I'm just using the Bermuda Bay side. And then I've got another piece of Bermuda Bay at two and a half inches by three and seven eighths. And a piece of white at two and three eighths by three and three quarters. And we'll go on top there. So we just need this piece to stamp on. And our ink. And our donkey. Right. And we'll place our donkey. Just pray standing up straight. Yeah. Our sentiments we use versifying. And I've got happy birthday, which goes along the bottom. Like that, quite nicely. And hey there, friend, which goes at the top here. That's our stamping done. 
Well, I'm just going to leave that to dry a minute and glue these down. lightest bit is going to go to the top of my card which makes sense and I don't think I did anything in so no. I haven't put anything inside because you don't know who's it's for. Alright, and that will have dimensionals on it when that sticks to it, so let's get the colouring in. Right, our donkey's grey this time. So I've got my grey ink and we're just colour him in in light smoky slate. Forgot. Forgot to open my donkey's eyes. So what I did is just, and then I don't like closed eyes. I prefer my donkeys to have open eyes. This is light, isn't it? Yeah. Just seems awfully dark at the moment, but I know it dries light. Just going around where a shadow would be. Uh -huh. I want that in darker grey. Just tufts of hair. Do it in darker grey and his tail as well. the shadows. donkey coloured in. Oh, I'm doing his face or his snout. His nose. That's better. 
Right then, with petal pink, we'll just put a bit in this wrong way. Beach in this snout and his inner ear. And his bottom lip as well. And we coloured it in grey. And I coloured his teeth yellow. Put these away. Oh no. Right, old olive for the stem and the leaf. Real red for the flower. Uh. And that is, oh no, 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 his hoofs need to win. There's our little donkey. Looks quite cute, doesn't he? Right, I'm going to glue this on here. And then pop him on dimensionals. What we got? And use up. The outside. All the back is removed and place him in the middle. Like that. And then with these Little tiny pearls. I'm going to put three dots just down here. I've got three left. Oh, can't pick them up. That's what. There we are. Hope you like it. It's a bit darker. If you do, give us a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more of my videos, please subscribe. And if you press the bell icon, you'll be notified of any more videos I upload, which is usually on Monday, Wednesday and Friday. All I can say is thanks for visiting, and I hope to see you again soon.